up guys brand new day and guess what i have a brand new e-bike to review this bike is by a company called romat link i will leave the romat link in the description down below if you guys are interested in checking it out so let's quickly go over some of these components so starting at the top it does come with a headlight button horn button there's going to be your control panel right here it also does have an lcd display seven speed shimano trigger shifter it also has a half twist throttle this bike is rocking mechanical disc brakes moving down we have the long giraffe neck stem if you guys don't like the look of this long stem head over to my website davidbrandnew.com pick up a turtleneck stem and bmx bars moving down it does have these mounts for like a front basket front rack front headlight right here it does come with front suspension as well plastic fenders and 20 by 4 inch fat tires guys this particular model is a step through frame and i am not a fan of it at all it looks looks horrible but what doesn't look horrible is this beefy freaking battery check this thing out it's freaking 48 volts but it's a freaking 30 amp hour battery that's ridiculous this thing is freaking big as hell moving up we do have a suspension seat post we have rear suspension in the back as well guys also moving up we have the rear seat moving down here's the motor for some reason this motor looks beefier than others but it is a 750 watt and here's going to be the shimano tourney derailleur and all the way at the rear we have the rear light all right let's go ahead and turn this bad boy on in order to do so you're going to hold the power button right here and it immediately turns on that's dope looks like we do have a color lcd display i could have sworn i charged this battery fully but it's looking like we don't have a full charge so the lcd shows you your battery level your speed your pedal assist level and your overall mileage on the bike let's test out this horn really quick super loud let me see if we can use throttle on pedal assist zero no we cannot all right let's put it in pedal assist one and we still don't have any throttle oh yeah we do it's just like barely dang okay so the throttle is linked to the pedal assist level let's go ahead and put it all the way up in five let's pick up some speed slow takeoff not gonna lie currently going 11 miles per hour also immediately i'm noticing that the battery level is dropping on the lcd display despite us having a 30 amp hour freaking battery i left this battery on the charger overnight and it should be fully charged but i don't know i don't know what's going on currently pedaling and we're going 22 miles per hour i am in gear seven i feel like a hamster like there's no resistance on this bike here let's pull over real quick let me see something I thought we might have had a, a derailleur guard that needed to be pulled out, but it looks like we don't even have a derailleur guard. Kind of sucks with this bike. Even in the highest gear, there's not a ton of resistance, so just be prepared for that. I will say the ride is super smooth though with the triple suspension. This is crazy. It's like I'm riding on a cloud right now. Let's see, throttle only. We're doing 21, 22 miles per hour. Let's tuck a little bit. I saw 23, there we go. 23 miles per hour throttle only not too bad it's not the fastest not the slowest all right let's go ahead and test out these brakes here we go they're decent all right here we go approaching our first hill let's see how fast we can go uphill throttle only 20 miles per hour 19 18 slowing down this is a 750 watt motor the battery is dropped to freaking two bars that's crazy guys i don't know what's going on with the battery currently going 13 miles per hour it's making it up the hill just fine but man this battery is acting weird all right here we go downhill let's see how fast we can go let's tuck currently going 25 26 26 that's it 27 come on man fully engaged in the throttle we're only going 28 miles per hour this bike is not fast at all good i'm not gonna lie from the looks i thought this bike was way faster than this it must have been the red color had me fooled guys this bike is only going 20 miles per hour dude the battery is only at one now it's scaring me we might have to cut today's trip short all right real quick let's see if we can make this bike any faster let's hold the plus and minus button at the same exact time here we go boom looks like we're in the menu settings that's good and they're claiming that this bike tops out at 51 kilometers per hour that is a god dang lie no way what's 51 kilometers per hour that's that's like 30 miles per hour they're claiming this bike goes 18 amps that's what it is okay so let's change the amperage it's only putting out 18 amps dang goes up to 31 that's crazy let's just do 25 all right i don't know if we just made the bike faster or not but we are only working with two 
bars. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Did we make the bike faster? Seems like we're going a little bit faster. Already going 22, 23 miles per hour. That's pretty good. Okay. All right, second hill of the day. Let's see how she does. We are only working with two bars of battery. Here we go. We are pedaling and engaging the throttle. We're currently going 18 miles per hour up this hill. Let me see, let me drop the gear a little bit. We're gonna drop it to, to five. There's no resistance, but we are still moving. 17 miles per hour, guys. Let's see, throttle only. Maintaining 17, uh oh, uh oh, we're dropping. Oh, we only dropped to 16, not bad, not bad. Let's go ahead and get into the turning lane, make this light. Oh yeah, let's stick the leg out for effect. Eee. We're gonna keep it pushing downhill. Let's see how fast this bike can go. Not as fast as that truck. Let's see if we don't engage the throttle and or pedal, how fast can we go? We're going 24 now, 25, we're picking up speed. Let's tuck a little bit, get some aerodynamics going. Can we hit 26 downhill? Looks like we're close to it, but no cigar. Oh, we got it. I saw it. It flashed 26. See if we can do it again. 26 miles per hour. Can you hit it? No, you can't. We're slowing down. The day number two on the Romat Link Dolphin. Unfortunate thing is that I put this bike on the charger last night and woke up today, took it off the charger to find out that we only have two freaking bars, guys, still. So I'm pretty sure we have a faulty charger. I already reached out to the company. They said they're gonna send me one. We're gonna do a quick ride. We're just gonna take it on our favorite off-road course. I wanna test out this suspension. You guys know it has triple suspension. So here we go, first suspension test around this corner we're gonna go up and oh my goodness did you hear that jesus uh. okay so this front suspension is trash horrible okay, let's take it easy right here oh my goodness that doesn't sound good all right so we have cheap suspension up front i will say the suspension seat post is doing this job we also are working with uh rear suspension in the back oh my god Dude, front suspension is horrid. All right, throttle only. We're doing 21 miles per hour still. Here we go. Hopefully there's no coyotes out. Whoo! Nice. Whoa. Yeah, suspension is super bouncy. The front is horrible. The rear is actually pretty good. And the suspension seat post is pretty good. If you're gonna be doing any off-road riding, I wouldn't be doing anything crazy. You're going to mess up that suspension. All right, let's go ahead and turn around. This is not the bike I want to get caught on by a freaking mountain lion. Here we go. I feel like this bike is more looks than anything. When I first saw it, I was super hyped to ride it because that super big battery. You know, I, I knew we were going to have a ton of range and I'm pretty sure you can get a ton of range out of this bike. It's unfortunate that we got a charger that didn't work. But other than the battery, this bike is just okay. It's not that fast. It also only has mechanical disc brakes, so I guess the real question is, how much does this bike cost? The price of this bike is $1,349. So this is gonna be a 750 watt e-bike. It does come with a 48 volt, 30 amp hour battery. They're claiming max range on this bike is 100 miles. And they're also claiming top speed on this bike is 25 miles per hour. It takes about nine to 10 hours to fully charge this big ass battery. And the max load on this bike is 350 pounds. Shout out to all my biggie boys. The bike weighs 93 pounds super heavy overall it's a decent bike it's not the best it looks decent i like the paint job on it i'm not a fan of the step through frame what's cool about this bike is it has a huge battery so you're gonna get a ton of range i like this rear passenger seat i have two kids so i would definitely utilize that the motor it's okay it wasn't super slow I weigh about 210 and I was going like 22 miles per hour on this bike. The color LCD display is a plus. The brakes are whatever, but I was super disappointed in this front suspension. I would say that's the weakest link on this bike. Other than that, it's a decent bike. And if you have the money, definitely check it out. I will leave a link to it in the description down below. That's going to do it for the video and hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Until the next one, the deuces like that. Yeah.